Stuart, that must be a brilliant feeling to, to come in, complete 90 minutes and, and get the win over our, our nearest, our local rivals. Yeah, exactly. Um, winning's always the best feeling in football, but to know, to come away from home with your local rivals and, and win on their patches um, is a big statement and it, and it shows what we've got in the dressing room. For you personally, obviously you've had that time on the sideline, you've had to watch it from the sideline. So coming in and getting 90 minutes under your belt, that must feel brilliant. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a tough start to the season for me, obviously watching the boys, you know, you, you want to help as much as you can, but uh, I'm back fit now, you know, um, I'm getting into it and obviously completed 90 today and, and with the win it'll only help and hopefully we can push on from now. It must have been a brilliant feeling celebrating with the fans at the end, obviously a sold out allocation there, seeing them at their best, so that must have been a great feeling. Yeah, they deserve that, you know, we all know we've had a tough few years, so for us to come here and give them that over the Christmas period, I'm sure they'll be delighted and, and they can go home happy and, and for us to share it with them is excellent, that's what football's yeah, about and, um, and, and we, we love to, uh, to make them happy. The gaffer spoke in our interview just now about how he asked all of you, you know, because with the big game against West Brom coming up, he said, you know, to all of you, you know, what game are you all focused on? You all said Woking, is that a kind of something that the gaffer's put in the dressing room that you know we are just focused on the next thing I think so I think like we have so many games you come in obviously so many competitions so mm. if you start thinking about X games you can't you can lose sight of where you are you know we know this is our league we know we've got a chance um, of doing really well this season so in a local derby there's nothing else to think about really West Brom will take care of itself next week but we um, we dealt with today and we can have a good week training enjoy the week and, and enjoy the occasion next Sunday 3-1 up, we're looking fairly comfortable and stuff and then obviously we concede a goal and, and Josh Stokes gets sent off mm -hmm. and puts us to 10 men as they're chasing an equaliser. You must be really proud of the lads around you for mucking in and, and not conceding further. Yeah, it's part of football. Um, you know, there's going to be tough times. We, um, I think we played, played a bit better in the second half, had a bit more control of, the, control of the ball but at times they're going to get ahead of steam. You know, they've got a late goal and the crowd gets behind them and we're down to 10 and it's sort of just digging at all costs and like I said, it shows a bit of resilience, shows a bit of bite where we might not have, um, we might not have had at the start of the season, so hopefully we're improving that end as well, and we can um, we can kick on from here. It's a brilliant, brilliant day. It finished nil nil on Boxing Day and three two today. So polar opposites, really. Is it is it a bit different to be on the pitch in those kind of games? Obviously, chasing one goal or, or goals going in left, right, and centre. Yeah, I think um, I think the start of the game set the tone really. I think they had a shot early on and just sort of set it from there. We, last week was a little bit cagey. Um, Obviously, we had had two, two poor results, so I think we were just lacking a little bit of confidence, weren't really opening up or going flat out. It was more of a, a safer performance, whereas today I feel like we were more back to ourselves mm. with um, chances created and taking control of the ball. And like I said, it made for a better game and a more entertaining game, and ultimately we won, we won which we know we, uh, we should do. And obviously, me and, me and you have seen it, we know that. Uh, we spoke about you being on the sidelines, but you have been around it, haven't you? Mm. You've been with the lads and in the dressing room at those times. So, is it good? Is it a good dressing room to be in? Is it, is it a good fun? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's a great dressing room. There's a great set of lads in there, and I think you can see that the way we play on the pitch. You know, we all give everything. We celebrate with the fans. It means everything to us. And there's there's boys in that dressing room that really want to kick on and, and, and do the best they can every time they play and put on the shirt. Um, we've got a great squad. It's not just the eleven. It's the boys on the bench who are not involved. You know, we're, we're all together in this, and we're going to enjoy the ride and, and see where it takes us. That's it, isn't it? First day of 2024 today. Start off with a win, and onwards and upwards, right? Yeah, can't argue. Yeah, first day of 2024. We've got a win away from home at our local rivals. So. We'll enjoy the week and move on to West Brom.